Okay guys, right now we are in our BMW Mini and as you can see here we have the ABS warning light showing on the dashboard here. Um, not exactly sure what the fault is, but we're, to diagnose the fault what we're going to do is use the BMW and Mini iCarsoft i910 scan tool. Uh, it should give us a good indication of what the fault is and if any parts need to be replaced. Uh, so the ABS is within the chassis system. That's the ABS system dynamic stability control. So it may take 30 seconds or so just to uh, communicate with the ABS system. Okay, so we'll read trouble codes. That's telling us wheel speed sensor, rear left. Uh, so it looks like we need to replace the rear left ABS sensor from this vehicle. Uh, so what we'll do is we'll go ahead and change that out, then we'll come back in the vehicle, uh, erase the trouble codes and see if we can get the ABS light uh, deleted from the dashboard. So we've got the wheel off here. And if you look at this cable here, this is the ABS sensor, so it runs down the back here and into the back of the hub there. And then we've already unclipped the ABS sensor. That is the ABS sensor there. So we'll replace that and then hopefully erase the codes and erase the warning light. Okay, so this is the replacement ABS sensor which we have here. You can see the uh, part number. It's not the same on all vehicles, but most minis of this age you will find the same part number. Um, so we're going to go ahead and fit this ABS sensor. Um, we picked this up from www.bavariandominator.co.uk. Uh, you can just search for uh, Dominator Auto Diagnostics in your Google search engine and you should find this website and navigate your way to the ABS sensors for mini vehicles. Alright, so we're back in the vehicle now. Um, what we've already done, um, we've just done it in fact, uh, using the iCarsoft i910 kit, is we've, um, well, we've just already uh, put the new ABS sensor in and then we've erased the trouble codes with the iCarsoft kit. And what you'll see it's done, I'll just turn the engine on here. You can see the ABS light has gone off straight away there. Um, so it's a successful diagnose and reset using the iCarsoft i910. Uh, if you are interested in this kit, just click the link directly below this video and it will take you to the page directly on our website. Uh, suitable for BMW and minis and will cover the ABS system as we've just seen and reset the ABS warning light. Thanks for watching this video.